What's your boy Z Gaming? I'm back for another video on the Walking Dead Road to Survival. And guys, in this video, coming at you real quick for the live war, it's Herschel's Farm against the Saviors from Heart Region. Shout out to um, Heart Region again. Um, let me just double check to see what the regions are real quick. Um, I believe it is. Um, let me just let me just see here really quick. I believe it's Heart, um, Bullock, and um, what is the other regions again? I can't remember um, what the regions are. Okay, here we go. So yeah, Heart. Um, um, Lincoln and the Bullock. Shout out to you guys again. Um, by the way, sh big shout out to Loaded Legends. You know, in first place right now. Um, shout out to Wayne and his re or in his um faction, Carnivorous Monsters. He let me know in the um event chat that um he is in a cross region war with me. So shout out to you, man, and your faction. Um, yeah. So as far as the prizes, real quick before the war starts. Um, the region rank awards is just your typical five star tokens, one hundred up to a thousand. I went over this in the last video. As far as the milestones, not bad, you know, trainers and then trainer bag and then a Ulysses isn't bad. The Benedict is okay. Um, the rest of the gear is not really that great unless you need it or you're in a newer region. But the trainers, you know, I do like the trainer bag. I wish they would give us maybe a couple more um, instead of some of this gear. But you know it is what it is. The milestones are not bad. Um, they're okay, but they're not great. Um, now, five star, now, as far as the um, actual rewards, you know, five-star tokens, a gear, um, a gear crate with one of these four-star, or excuse me, one of these six star pieces you need, you know, hockey mask, whetstone, double holsters, and magazine bandolier, and then some um, Lilith, so not bad. Um, a thousand five star tokens all the way up to 18,000. Then, as long as you get in the top 600, you'll get a crate, and then the top one gets um, three crates, and then you um, Lilith, you'll get one. And like I said, again, as long as you get in the top 600, and the first one will get four of them, so not bad. Um, prizes overall ain't bad. I know a lot of people want to see an ascendable six star character, or excuse me, ascendable six five star character. Um, you know, and I can agree with that, but I still like the five star tokens because at least it gives us some fodder um, to ascend another character. But you know, future reference, I would assume Scopely will eventually put ascendable five stars into the game or unique five stars that you only get for that cross region war. I think that would be a good idea. But um, without further ado, guys, let's get into this war real quick. Let me know how you guys are doing in War Two, by the way. Um, like I said, we're in fourth place right now. It's actually pretty close between the top three. You know, all within about two hundred thousand. Actually, really, it's pretty close. For the top five, um, you know, with it over a day and nine hours left, you know, anything can happen. So let's see what we can do real quick. Um, I'm going to try to get this mansion real quick. So let's see what we can do here. Uh, let me make sure I put my right defense up. Okay, yeah, I did. All right, we're good. So let's get this mansion really quick. Um, and the, the towers are not bad. They're, they're kind of similar to what they were last time, but you know it is what it is. Um, so let me go ahead and attack with this. We'll take this team right here. Um, this isn't my go-to tower attack team, but what I've noticed, I went over this in a previous video before, the team that you use last is usually the team that it goes to like when you first go to attack. So um, what I would do is go to a team that you want to use for your tower take um, and just kind of use that team, maybe I guess to scout or something at the end. Well, not scout at the end, you can do that at the beginning um, and it will go straight to that team because the way they do it, like you guys seen there, this was the last team I used on attack, so that's why it chose this team for the tower. And I didn't want to scroll through because sometimes those crucial seconds can be the difference between getting a tower and not getting it. And I can take, um, I did not mean to use them skills. That could actually cost me the tower. Um, like I said, guys, taking towers, I would not advise you use ARs unless you're going to use a group hitter like Rocket Launcher Abraham or something. That's about the only time I would say to use the AR because you can kill more zombies before um, it starts. I don't think I got this tower, though. Okay, I actually did get it, so that's cool. Um, I know I don't have the best tower defense. I'm gonna, I'm still tweaking it to see what we can do. Um, so let me see what we're doing here really quick. Okay, so here we go. Let's see what we can do here. Um, let's see what this guy has. So shout out to this guy. Let's see what we got. So we got an Ezekiel. I'm going to go ahead and kill that guy first because he's a big threat to me as far as his AR going off. Then I'm going after this blue Dwight. Or not Dwight, excuse me. Um, okay, he's got a stun weapon. I didn't even notice that on Carl, so I'm going to have to be careful of that. Um, yeah, and he's getting all kinds of stuns right now, so I got to be even more careful. Let me see here. Okay, let me go ahead and do that. And then what I'm going to do, oh, uh, man, I'm not going to be able to kill him, but that's fine. I'll go ahead and do this. Go ahead and taunt both of them, and then I'll go ahead and kill him. I think Carl's going to go off, but that's fine. Let me see. Okay, yeah, Carl went off, but that's fine. Yumiko shouldn't be able to kill me since she's taunted, so I'm just going to keep attacking Yumiko, take her out, and then I'll hit Carl with Mirabelle and then the white, and that should take him out. So there we go. Let me go ahead and stun him real quick. And then I'll take him out with the white. Um, if you guys didn't know that too, by the way, that weapon, if you do have it, use it on the white. You can get up to four attacks. can be very crucial in um, attacks for sure. Um, let's see what this guy has. So he's got a Mirabelle lead. Um, he's got an Andrea. 
six star Tyrese Kenny. So, you know, I still see people from time to time using that um Rosita because of of a revive. But in my opinion, um, I just I don't I wouldn't use her. If you're gonna use a five star blue revive, if you got them, I would definitely recommend a Hunter a hundred percent because Hunter's a lot better um than the Rosita now in my opinion because of his Indomitable. Um, but let me go ahead and stun, and that's a good combination too, guys. Um, it's two Mirabelles, the six star version and the five star version. I get two turns of stun basically. I can stun it two thirds of the team, two turns back to back, and that's pretty crucial. Um, especially with the weapons and stuff, because weapons are a big part of the game now, as you guys see. So let's see what this guy has. He's got Ivanova, Revive Jesus. Okay, that's not the six star, so I'm not too worried about that guy. Um, so let me go after Ivanova, and then I'll take out the Revive Jesus next turn. So we'll go ahead and hit him next. Okay, he got stunned actually, so I'm going to go after this Eugene since he got stunned. Not going to bother with him too much. And then I'll attack this Ezekiel, so let's go ahead and do this. We're going to go ahead and use them. That should be able to take out them, and then I'll stun. And then I should be able to finish him off next turn. So there we go. Kill him off with Mirabelle and um, Abraham. So there we go. Um, let me know what you guys think of the prizes as well. As far as that 5-star Ascendable, I agree with it, but let me know what you guys think. Do you think that Scopely should make maybe unique 6-stars? Or, excuse me, not six stars, but unique five stars that can be ascendable. Or would you just like to see maybe a unique character um, as far as a character, you know, that can be um, just a character you get from that war specifically? Kind of how the um, Red Andrea was when Cross Region War came out. It was still early in the stages. And I forgot to kill him because he's going to go off, but that's fine. Um, kind of how that Red Andrea was in the beginning when you could only get her from that Cross Region War. And she was a pretty rare character because only a few people had her at the time. Um, I think that would be a cool idea, but you know, um, let me know what you guys think of it in the comments below. So let's go ahead and use the cam real quick. We'll attack this guy next. Let's see what he has. So same thing. I'm going to take out this guy cause I don't want him to go off. What is alpha got in pairs? So I'm not going to attack alpha. Um, I'm going to go after Shiva next because Shiva's got a stun on her weapon. So let me go ahead and do this. All right. So what I'm going to do, hopefully he doesn't kill my mirror bell. We'll see. Okay. We're fine. Uh, let me go ahead and stun. And then I got to remove these shields, so let me attack, and then we should be fine next turn. So I'll go ahead and do that. That should kill Alpha, and then I'll go ahead and do that, and hopefully that can kill um, both of them. If not, okay, yeah, we're fine. There we go. We took out Carl. I thought Carl was going to survive, but it's all good. Dwight does a lot of damage with that weapon. Was very lucky to get them two criticals back-to-back -back without even using any um, duct tape or anything. Oh, man, I don't know why that popped up. That pops up sometimes on my device. I don't know why it says that sometimes. It happens, but let's see what we can do here. Um, I haven't seen 5-star yellow Clementine lead in a while, so that's kind of strange. Um, so there we go. Um, let me see here. Okay, so what I need to do... Okay, let me see. Um, let me see. I need to get rid of this Shiva. Uh, let me attack him. Go ahead and take him out. Hopefully, I can get rid of one of these guys. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to do anything about this. So they are going to go off. That kind of sucks. Okay, he healed, so what I need to do, I need to get rid of Clementine because she might be able to kill one of my characters, and I don't want that. So there we go. All right, we're good. So, all right, Dr. Sa I haven't seen this guy too much as well. I kind of want to get him just because he's a unique five-star from the Survivor Road Depot. I haven't seen him too much. I've seen him on a couple teams, but there we go. Got a can, so let's get this guy. Trip lead. Okay, so not bad. He's got a six-star Tyrese. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to kill off the revives first because I don't want them to heal anybody. And then I'm going to leave that that Tyrese alone, actually, for a minute. And I'm going to go after this guy next, and I'm going to attack Trip. And then we should be able to kill Tyrese next turn, so we're good. Let me go ahead and stun him, and if he doesn't die this turn, I'll hit him with Mirabelle next turn. All right, there we go. Um, this is a good team. The only change I'm going to make in the future is eventually Carl's going to get taken out, and I'm going to put six-star blue Tyrese in because Carl is my weakness in that attack team. Um... But it's only really because I use them because of the stun katana, so I can stun the shield. But let's see, I've got two defends. Um, how many more? Okay. All right, I got three defends so far, so let me see. One. Um, let me see. Mm, how many more did I get? Let me check. Let's see. So I think it's only three so far. Two right there. Okay, so yeah, I got three in total. I missed one, but, you know, I got three, so that's not too bad. Um, so I got one hit left. Let me see who's left. All right, so let me go ahead and hit this Nala, I think is how you say that. Um, so not bad. Okay, he's got another six-star Tyrese. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of that Andrea because she's got that double attack weapon. Then I'm going to take out Tyrese next, and then I'll go ahead and use um 
use my uh that stunned um Herschel to build the rest of my AR. So see, as you can see, Carl almost died there, and that could have been very bad. So I'll go ahead and stun Mirabelle since she's not gonna die this turn, but that's fine. So I'll kill her off with Carl next. There we go. Um, I've been having kind of iffy luck as far as attacking so far with the weapons. Sometimes I hit pretty good and sometimes I don't. But there it is, guys. A live war coming for you. Just got another cancel. That's cool. Um, I'll show you guys a couple more wars and let me know what you guys think of the prizes. And let me know, again, like I said, how you're doing in the war and stuff. And with all that really being said, I'll show you guys these once they're done as well. I'm going for 30% attack and um, another um, zombie weapon. So I'll show you guys those once they're done. But um, there it is, guys. Again, shout out to these regions. I believe it's the... Let me just check again really quick. Um, shout out to the top, or where, where is it? I Sometimes I have trouble finding it. Um, let me see, really quick, where is it at? I don't want to take too much time looking for this, so. Okay, yeah, again, shout out to Hart, shout out to Lincoln, and shout out to Bullock. I believe that's how you say it, but I could be wrong. Um, pretty good team so far. You guys got some interesting teams, and it's always nice. That's why I like cross-region war, because it's a variety. You get to see different teams than normal in your region. But, um. Without further ado, guys, you know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. If you want a possible shout-out, drop it in the comments or message me over line. My line ID is in the description of every video. Thank you guys again for all the support. If you want to make me a team as well, the offense is in the description. Just click on the link, comment on offense, and I'll use it in the video and give you a shout-out for it. If you use Discord as well or want to get a Discord, um, it's a free app kind of similar to Line. Just join the chat room. The link to that is also in the description. And with all that really being said, guys, this is your boy Z Gaming. Peace.